Earlier today, the grand jury returned indictments against five former Memphis Police Department officers regarding the death of Tyree Nichols. Here are the charges. Second degree murder, aggravated assault, aggravated kidnapping resulting in bodily injury, aggravated kidnapping involving the possession of a weapon, official misconduct through unauthorized exercise of power, official misconduct through failure to act when there is a duty imposed by law, and official oppression. While each of the five individuals played a different role in the incident in question, the actions of all of them resulted in the death of Tyree Nichols, and they are all responsible. Let me close by saying both to the family of Tyree Nichols and to the broader community here in Memphis and Shelby County, we all want the same thing. We want justice for Tyree Nichols. It's my hope that if there is any silver lining to be drawn from this very dark cloud, it's that perhaps this incident can open a broader conversation about the need for police reform. The world is watching us and we need to show the world what lessons we can learn from this tragedy. I'm hopeful that we can show them who I know us to be, a community working towards positive change here in Memphis and Shelby County. There was an initial traffic stop. We won't comment right now on the presence or absence of the legality of the stop, but there was a traffic stop. And there was an initial altercation uh, involving several officers and Mr. Nichols. Um, pepper spray was deployed. Uh, the uh, suspect, or not the suspect, Mr. Nichols, uh, fled on foot. <clears throat> there was another altercation uh, at a nearby location at which the, the, the serious injuries uh, were experienced by Mr. Nichols. After some period of time of um, waiting around afterwards, he was taken away by an ambulance. Beyond that, I don't really think I, we should go into any further details. So, so there was a delay in a call? The police delayed calling an ambulance for the, there was a, There was an elapsed period of time, but I believe that if you watch the video, you'll be able to make that judgment for yourself.